projectile vomiting, black eye. My assistant got mugged by eight men. Couldn't get an Uber ever. Makeup got cancelled. When my assistant got mugged and like punched in the face, he was delirious the next day and walked in the wrong direction for an hour and a half and totally <laughs> missed our makeup test. <laughs> Dior bag has been destroyed. Yeah. That's pretty big deal. <laughs> um, anyway, that's fashion week. So today and for the rest of this week, I'm going to be taking you with me around Paris for Paris Fashion Week. I'm here working on four shows, including Otterlinger, Vivian Westwood, Yoji Yamamoto and Jean Battista Valley. So I'll be giving you a bit of an insight into behind the scenes. You can get up close to the models, recreate some of the looks, see how we do stuff um, and basically just follow me around on this absolutely crazy <laughs> mental week in Paris. So we're backstage at Yoji Yamamoto's Spring Summer 22 in Paris. I'm here with the makeup team in this amazing um, place. We're at Hotel de Ville in central Paris. It's the first time I'm working with Yoji Yamamoto, which is like I've been incredibly lucky and a really huge aspiration of mine is to work with him because you know he's one of the designers that have really been incredibly significant in culture in the last like 20 30 years working on his show is really interesting a bit of a new experience because I think it teaches you something about respect, a way of doing things that feels very different to how we do them in, say, like London or America. There's a huge amount of attention to detail that goes into their shows. And, you know, there's this real sense of like an authoritative figure that everybody really looks up to and aspires. And I feel like, uh, especially with Japanese designers, there's a real sense of community and working towards one real singular vision, which is kind of an amazing experience. <laughs> This is one of the completed looks. Um, Eugene Solomon is on hair and we together we've kind of created um, this. Gosh, I don't even know how to explain it. <laughs> this crazy hair and makeup look. Outfit of the day. <laughs> dressed it with pieces and then we wrapped these um, pieces of leather barbed wire across the face. She's just got it around her head, some models have it around the face. And then we've finished with a very defined white eye, lashes and kind of very minimal skin. So that is the show that's Smoking kills, Joe. There we go, there we go. <laughs> And then Jamati Savali I work with every year, which is wonderful. He always does really beautiful, imaginative things. Last season we stuck, you know, flowers, fresh flowers all over the girls' faces. We've done things with big Swarovski crystals. This season it was all about creating a really high impact coral lip. Are doing a really gorgeous, very glassy coral lip. So we're backstage with all of the team here. It's show sponsored by Mac. Um, this was the colour, <laughs> but I've kind of divvied it out now, and we're gonna just giving it a bit of a boost with this really lovely bright corally pigment, and then we're gonna be going in in lineup with a beautiful lip gloss just to give it that really perfect glassy finish. <laughs> It's just a beautiful show, and we we were in what's the art gallery called, Le Musée d'Art Moderne, this year. So that's a really great space to work in. The other show I did in Paris was with Vivian Westwood, who are for like family to me, and I work with them every season. It's Andreas's show in Paris, and that's just like going to work with your family really so it's always wonderful. I even enjoy going to the tests because I just like to hang out with them and the team and um, it's just it makes coming to Paris feel really special. We are backstage at the Andreas Pronth and Lefer Vivian Westwood show in Paris. I'm working with Byredo today so we have a really big team using uh, Byredo products to create some of the looks. 
The main look is a really kind of like raw natural base with really brushed brows. We're using the um, the brow. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, I'm so tired. We're using the brow pencil and we are using the mascara just to kind of open everybody's eyes up a little bit. Then we have created this hero look. So we've used some of the colours uh, from the colour sticks and also the lipsticks to create the kind of pinky effect on the cheeks and on the eyes. And then I've gone in with the chin of gold colour stick and then I'm going to be using the prismic palette just to layer over and really create that kind of like really bold gold effect. My favourite part of Paris Fashion Week, the food. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, the food. My least favourite part of Paris Fashion Week, oh, trying to book a car, man. It's so, it's like impossible. Especially this season, there were just no Ubers, no taxis. Uh, so when you're like carrying around five suitcases full of stuff, heavy makeup stuff. If you do it too much on the top, on the bottom Transportation can be like, can kind of make or break your day. If you have to wait for an hour because you can't get a cab, I mean, you're screwed, aren't you? So that's pretty annoying. I do look forward to it. I do look forward to seeing my friends and the designers and uh, there's a definitely a sense of community and, and, and you know everyone goes out for dinners and you go to parties and I think that's a really wonderful part of everything is, is the community thing. The travelling is hard. I'm very lucky this year I've had two assistants with me that have, well three assistants actually that have sort of helped with moving suitcases and unpacking because it's just so much stuff to carry with you um, and they've been wonderful. How, the How do I maintain my energy? Barocca, <laughs> paracetamol, ibuprofen, coffee. Sometimes things like Vicks are really good. You just put some under your nose and it kind of wakes you up. Energy, I mean, you just gotta, you just, there's no option really, is there? You just gotta keep going. And then you crash afterwards. So you just keep going, 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 and you crash. And then you sleep, <laughs> or not in my case. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Next time I'll try and take even more <laughs> footage of all of the early morning wake-ups and the annoying cab journeys and all the other stuff that I missed out. But I hope you got to see a little bit of what happens behind the scenes over a fashion week in Paris. Mm -hmm.